Hi, I'm Sherry Ann Richardson from experimentalhomesteader.com and today we are have this passion fruit and I'm going to attempt to germinate the seeds. So the first thing I need to do is cut it open. Okay, it's hollow inside. I don't know if you could hear that. Here comes the juice. And as you can see, it's filled with seed. So what I'm going to do is scrape these seeds out. From the smell of this, this is just a little bit overripe. That makes it perfect. Okay. And the juice is okay because one of the uh, tricks to getting passion fruit seed to germinate is to have some of this juice because of the acidity. And so if someone sends you passion fruit seeds and you can't get passion fruit juice, then what you do is you can use a little bit of orange juice. Okay. Okay. All right. And this is what, I don't know how well you can see this, but this is basically what the inside of the shell of the passion fruit looks like completely cleaned out and this is just a canning jar that I filled with hot water and just one of the lids you can get and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the juice the seeds and all right down in this hot water okay just like that and I'm going to allow this to soak for two or three days more than likely, I will change this water out several times, um, making sure that I rinse the seeds off really well. Because what the goal is here is to get all of this pulp off of the seeds so I have clean seeds. And at that point, they should easily germinate. Um, I like to germinate mine in paper toweling. And that way, I'm only planting seeds that I'm sure are germinated. You can germinate them directly in soil, just like you would any other seed. Um, but as I see it said, I prefer to only plant the seeds that are actually germinated. And I typically plant them in peat pots, one seed per peat pot. And that way I feel like I'm not wasting my peat pots and I'm not wasting my soil. And again, these are passion flora seeds. I'm Sherri Ann Richardson from experimentalhomesteader.com.